Now to the strained relationship between the U.S. and Pakistan. Since the U.S. raid on bin Laden's compound, Pakistan arrested five CIA informants suspected of helping that operation. And the CIA gave Pakistan the location of a bomb manufacturing site. But someone in the Pakistani intelligence alerted the terrorists who emptied out the site. During a Capitol Hill hearing yesterday, Defense Secretary Robert Gates told Senator Patrick Leahy even supposed allies are not always honest with each other. How long do we support governments that lie to us? When do we say enough is enough? Based on um, 27 years in CIA and four and a half years in this job, most governments lie to each other. That's the way business gets done. The chairman of the Joint Chiefs, Admiral Mike Mullen, admitted criticism of Pakistan is warranted, but warned the U.S. can't afford to drop Pakistan as an ally, he says. If we walk away from it, it's my view it'll be a much more dangerous place a decade from now, and we'll be back. Mullen noted that what makes Pakistan especially dangerous is the mixture of terrorists and that Pakistan does have nuclear weapons.